Hi everybody, it's time to do some rhythm activities. Today our rhythm activity is based on Carnival of the Animals. Remember last week when we listened to March of the Lion from Carnival of the Animals? It was written by a famous French romantic composer and his name was Camille Saint-Saëns. Can you practice saying his last name with me? Say Saint-Saëns. Good job. Well, we have some animal rhythms to practice today. Here's the first one because we got to see March of the Lion last week. Whenever you see this lion picture, we're going to clap this rhythm. Lion, try it with me. Lion, try it again. Lion, did you try patting it on your lap? Let's try that. Pat on your lap and say it ready, go. Lion, one more time. Lion, good job. I'm going to put him on our rhythm board for today. Here's another animal rhythm. What's that one? Yes, it's a fish. Let's try, I'm gonna pat. You can pat or clap, you decide. Ready, here we go. Fish, say it again, fish. Play and say, fish. Good job. Let's put the fish on our rhythm board next to the lion. Okay, here's another one. What's this animal? Octopus, that's right. Here's how we say it in rhythm. Octopus, say it with me. Octopus, clap and say it. Octopus, good job. I'm gonna put the octopus up here next to the lion and the fish. And here's our last one for today. Yes, of course, we have to have an alligator because we live in Florida. There are lots of alligators. All right, so this one sounds like this. Alligator, try it with me. Alligator, say it and clap it. Alligator, good job. So now we have all four animal rhythms on our rhythm board. Can you see all four of them in a row? Now we're going to say and clap all four of them in a row. I can't really clap because I'm holding the board up, but will you clap or pat while we say these animal rhythms in a row? Ready, everybody, here we go. Lion, fish, octopus, alligator. Hey, that was pretty good. Now guess what? It is your turn to be a composer. We are going to use these animal rhythms and we're gonna make a brand new pattern. That's what composers do. They take notes and rhythms and they rearrange them to make new patterns. That's what we're gonna to do today. So let's rearrange these. Hmm, I think I wanna put the fish at the end. What do you think, do you like that? I hope so. Okay, and I think I'm gonna put the alligator at the beginning just cause Alligators are cool. Okay, see what I did? I was being a composer and rearranging those rhythms in there. Let's try saying it like this, and we're going to say it in this order twice in a row without stopping in between. So get ready to pat or clap and say these rhythms twice in a row. Ready, everybody, here we go. Alligator, lion, octopus, fish. Alligator, lion, octopus, fish. Did you do it? Great job. Thank you for doing the rhythms with me. Have a great time with your lesson.